Hey, what's up guys? DTQ Jack here, coming at you with a little Referium information. I'm here to help you guys set up a Ethereum wallet and start uh, receiving tokens on from your Referium gains. So I'm just going to log in to Referium here. I'm going to click that and click the Twitch thingy. I've already logged into TTQ Jack over here. And here we go. And you click up at the top right up here. And you go to your account. So you can see I haven't set uh, my Ether address yet. So uh, I, you can use, they recommend two options, either MetaMask or My Ether Wallet. I'm personally more familiar with My Ether Wallet. So I'm going to show you guys how to create a new wallet in, in here. So my Aether Wallet is basically a website that uh, allows you to interact and create a private wallet. So this this doesn't actually store anything. It just kind of provides the uh, platform to interact and do certain things. So create a wallet. We're going to make a password. Password. Create new wallet. Nine characters. Password. 007. Create new wallet. All right, so it's going to give you this file here, guys. This file is basically like the key that unlocks your wallet. So you're going to want to find it. You're going to want to save this and put it somewhere safe. And yeah, there's a lot of security stuff about this, guys. Uh, if you're just dealing with referring tokens, uh, probably not a huge concern. But lots of people use this for you know thousands of dollars of Ethereum and all sorts of other altcoins and stuff like that. So I'm going to download this key store file. We'll just save it. Uh, and then, let's see, there it is right there. Understand. So this is a private key. This is the key that will uh, allow you to get into your wallet. So I put this somewhere safe. Uh, write it down on a piece of paper. You can print it out, a paper wallet, uh, all sorts of stuff. So let me go save your address, and then you can access your wallet. So I'll show you how to do that real quick. You're going to use the key store, which is that file we just got. And then if I just go to, actually I can probably just click and drag this down there. No, that, that doesn't work. Anyway. Uh, yeah, we can get into that now. Um, I am going to go back, though. I didn't show you guys how to get it, so your public key is the one that you'll want. So let's let's go to send ether. This is just pretty much how you get into your wallet. So I'm going to click send ether. We're going to go here. Let's find this file we just saved. should be in downloads, I assume. Here we go, UTC, that's it. Your wallet's encrypted. Password 007. Unlock. And there we go. So now, so we can see our, this is the public address right here. Uh, you can see we have no Ether. Token balances, you can, this is where your Referium tokens will show up. So you can show all tokens there to uh, check to see if you've received any. But yeah, this, that's pretty much the basics. So I'm going to, if I were to use this account, I would copy this. I already have uh, DTQ's public Ethereum wallet copied into my uh, clipboard here. So I'm just going to paste that in. Let me make sure that's different. It starts with a 0x, so you know that's right. And then I'm just going to hit save. So I should be receiving my Referium tokens here eventually. Who knows when? Hopefully soon. But yeah, hopefully that helps you guys out. Please reach out if you have any more questions. I'll probably be making a video on. Uh, this is interesting. Connecting to Google. Yeah, I'll probably make a, a video on the rest of Ethereum here shortly. Or Referium. Probably referring them in 
Ethereum, actually. But yeah, thanks for checking this out, guys. Hope it helps. And thanks for questing. Hopefully we're getting that partnership soon, so we'll we'll see you guys then. Cheers.